All right, today what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a bootstrap template. We're gonna upload it to an AWS bucket. We're gonna make that template available on the web. And then additionally, we're gonna make one small change just to show you the workflow. The first thing we need to do is we need to get our bootstrap template. We search bootstrap templates, should come up. First thing, find one that tickles your fancy. We'll use agency. We'll go ahead and say download. This will download a zip file we need to extract. So we'll open this up. We will drag then drop that to extract it. Over here now, we see we have bootstrap agency GH pages. What this is, is the entire contents of that bootstrap pack uh, template. What we need to do now is put this into a bucket. Let's show the login process. I'll go to aws.amazon.com. Sign into the console. If you don't have an account, you'll need to get one. There's a good chance it'll come up with a list of services. Under storage, you'll click on S3, and then you'll need to create a new bucket. The bucket name will be whatever website you want to do, www.thisisabadexample.com. We don't need versioning or logging, but what we do need to do is make sure that everything is readable by the public. So under public permissions, say grant public read access to this bucket. Next, create bucket. This will create the bucket, and over on your buckets, you can find it in the list. This is a badexample.com. Click that, and then go ahead and say upload. Now we need to drag and drop the files from this template. Everything should show up in here. Go ahead and say next. What we need to do again is make sure that all of these have public read access, and go ahead and click upload. While this is uploading, or after it's uploaded, you can go to Properties for this bucket and say Static Website Hosting. Here, use this bucket to host a website. Click that. Make sure that index.html is the index document. That's the main landing page. Say Save. And once everything is uploaded, you can come to the Static Website Hosting and click on this is a bad example.com.s3 website, US West, Amazon, blah, blah, blah. And voila. We have a website, but let's pretend we want to change something because evidently we are going to want to. What we can do here is go ahead and change a file. So file, open. We're going to edit the index. And what we want to do is go ahead and say, welcome to our studio. We will now say, welcome to a bad example. We'll go ahead and save that file. Now back here on AWS, what we're going to do is we're going to go to the bucket. And we're going to say upload, add files, add all of the files that we changed, index.html, say open. We need to again make sure that it's publicly readable. Upload. And we come over here and refresh the page. Welcome to a bad example. Thank you so much.